Hey, in this video, we're going to show you how to remove the CD player on a 2004 Chrysler Crossfire. Uh, you're going to need these two tools. They are they're sold online. They're for radio removal. Not really sure on the name, but you need these specialty tools. So you insert them into the inserts. You make sure they click in. And then the radio just slides out. All right, now just unplug the plugs. There's the button on the driver's side that you press and it comes out. Okay, and let me show you how the tools work. All right, so this is what these tools do when you insert. They press down the locking tabs on both sides and allows you to pull out the CD player. So it just slides out basically. Okay. That's all it is. And this is a factory CD player. Hey, in this video we're going to show you how to remove the climate control off a 2004 Chrysler Crossfire. So once you remove the CD player, there's going to be Phillips screws right underneath. I'll try to get a better view. Then you have another one right here. Okay, so we removed two Phillips screws. All right, so now we're gonna be removing this trim. We're using this plastic tool. Uh, it's a plastic wedge. I'm just going to wedge it in through all the cracks all around. Just kind of be patient with it, kind of work through the clips. You could use a flathead, but just kind of be careful not to damage it. Continue removing the climate control. So you're going to have to use a flathead to press on this release button, tab. Okay, so that's how you remove the client control. And if you're stuck, you can't pull it out, you probably skipped the step of removing the two screws on the bottom of it. And just in case, you do have another tab on the other side. But usually just one side, once you press it, it just slides out, so it's not a big deal. The plug, once you press this, it's going to allow you to pull this out. So that's the plug for the climate control.